With our wonderful climate, one of the very best things about Australia has been the large number of public swimming pools. This has been a great Australian institution over the years. Open, affordable, people mixing together freely, regardless of their uh, background, their race or their religion. Now, the Australian institution of the public swimming pool, open to all, is under threat because the Cumberland Council has decided to erect a petition or a curtain at Auburn Pool so that Islamic women are segregated on one side of the pool and the rest of the community are uh, separated to the other side. It's uh, segregation in Australia on the basis of Sharia law because the Quran says that Islamic women can't show the bare flesh to men. The council's put this curtain, this petition in place to make sure that the communities are kept apart. We shouldn't have Sharia law at local government level. I say tear down that curtain. Let's have a look at how bad it is. Who would have thought this tiny pool behind these big curtains? Where should curtains be used in normal day life? On your window to stop people perving at you when you've got no gear on. Not in a public swimming pool. Could create such a tidal wave of emotion. What a load of crap. And I think this is a shame. I think it's for the whole community. It's, um, it's a local community pool. At your local pool, you'd expect to find curtains in your changing rooms, right? But here, they've been put up around the entire pool, effectively segregating it from the rest of the aquatic centre, mainly to accommodate female Muslim swimmers. And as you'd expect, that's created more than a few waves. Now, the Australian way would be to say to these Islamic women, it's your individual responsibility, if you've got modesty issues, to cover up. Wear the bikini, for instance. And for the men at Auburn, it's doubly resentful. They've paid their rates. They pay at the entry turnstile. They're being doubly punished here. They're paying their money twice, and they can't access all of the facility. The Australian way has always been that if there's a public amenity, it's available fully to all members of the public. So this segregation... This Sharia law, this separatism at Auburn Pool has got to end. Now, we've raised this at Mark Latham's Outsiders. I want to go a step further. Go to my website, www.teardownthatcurtain.com, and sign the petition. We're going to put pressure on the Cumberland Council to enforce Australian traditions of egalitarianism, people mixing together freely, no segregation, no curtains, no separatism. Go to the website, sign the petition. We're going to put pressure on this council. They've got elections in September of 2017. We're going to fight hard to tear down that curtain. I'm Mark Latham for Rebel Australia. Don't forget the website, teardownthatcurtain.com. Share the petition on Facebook. Share it on Twitter. Support our campaign.